Yo homes, welcome back to another illustrated tutorial and in this one I'll teach you how to make a paper texture in illustrator. For this you do need one proper paper texture a photo or a vector for it uh, if you want to use the one I'm using link to a set in the description below but you can use anyone you can even uh, take a photo yourself and use it the process actually is extremely easy is more of a trick and uh, let's just uh, create a few elements that we want to look like they have been typed out or uh, printed on the paper in this case to make them look like they have been printed on this paper and just any random thing to make it easier to edit later on, we'll divide the elements into two layers one for the paper as background and one for the elements now just select the layer of the elements, go to properties, select opacity and change the blending mode to multiply. Yep, that's it. That's how it is. Multiply basically removes the whites of the element and adds the colors of it as if, as if to darken the on the layers below it which is pretty much how paper in real life works you write on it or print on it with the ink on a lighter colored paper which adds to the darkness of the paper and makes it readable in some form you want it to so that's how you use a paper texture in illustrator it's quite simple as you have seen that completes this tutorial now just uh, play with the elements a bit so that you get you get the ultimate look you're going for and subscribe for more and like the video and share the knowledge with your friends and hit the bell notification to get notified when i upload a new video and <laughs> get my uh, stock elements like this paper texture from 2020 and sell stock account links in the description below follow me in other social media this links to them link in the description below and yeah again thanks for watching and step up the crowd keep great bye bye